humor is key to the uh, Overlord experience. And without humor, the parody, the game would probably get banned. Be gone, you beast, and make it fast. For if you don't, we'll kick you. It's great to have uh, Rihanna Pratchett back again to write the story. Humor is something that's often very tricky in games, because often it feels tacked on. Uh, in Overlord, we have made sure to fully integrate humor into the game. Now the hunt begins. Humor it seeps through in all elements, from grotesque things that the minions do, from the character visuals to the crazy objectives that the Overlord has. For example, at one point he has to get a ship out of the ice. Instead of doing that in a subtle way, you know, he just melts the polar ice caps and creates a massive environmental disaster. Our inspiration for the Overlord game was regular fantasy. We like fantasy, but got a bit still, always being the good guy, fighting against evil. So we thought it was a great opportunity to sort of turn things around for once. You are the evil guy and kill those nasty heroes who come after you and rule the world. I think it's a lot more fun being evil anyway. The inspiration for the minions came from uh, pets, loyal pets, like a dog who does whatever you say and uh, you know is super loyal. But of course we didn't want to have like uh, you know fluffy creatures following the overlord around so we made them devilish and uh, imp-like. Thus the minions were born. Well, there's a little bit of Overlord in everybody. Everybody has an evil tendency and Overlord is just a game where you can just let it go without hurting someone.